How to add the here in this video, we are going to learn how to create a script that will turn these lines to walls and we can bring those lines from CAD or even you can design your plans in a one line way in Revit and then when you're good with it, then you can uh, convert all of those lines to walls very easily. But there are some tips and there are some things that you need to consider about it. Because I'm not going to make that make the tutorial that complex. I didn't make these uh, walls or these uh, partitions in a two-line way that we see in our plan. So I made them in uh, with one line so to make our work much easier. Because in that way you have to do lots of coding and it will take long time. But right now, for example, I have been designing something. So because it is faster to design it in 2D, I would do it in 2D and then I will use this script to turn it in 3D. To do that, you have to go to Revit and bring your cat file in here. And let's open Dynamo, let's go to the Manage tab and let's open Dynamo. So let's create a new one. The first thing that you have to do, let's go to the Revit part and selection and select element select model element yeah we have it right now bring it in and then you can select the cat file in here and then to do the process for the on this cat file you have to have a package which is being for nodes be morph nodes because it will give you a lot of tools to work with you have to install be morph nodes from the packages part and in here we have a node which called is care from cat layers let's bring it in but before that let's put the run mode on manual and let's bring the import instance which are which is uh, our element or which is our cat file and then we have the layer names i can create a code block and let's call it zero because the zero is, uh, the layer of those lines is zero and i don't want to do anything with this now we have i have some lines I if I would run it and now we have we can see the lines in here but before doing anything consider the list is not in a good shape for uh, now so I'm going to get item at, in, uh, at uh, index but you can see we can't get the uh, only curves out of it too so let's just uh, turn off the preview of it and let's bring a watch node now let's extract the curves in here and let's run again now we have the uh, curves only now the next step is to just create a just go to the revit part and now in here in the elements part we have a wall node which will allow you to create a wall by uh, curve and height or by curve and levels i want to do it with, with y curve and levels or by levels so let's bring it in and now let's do the uh, let's uh, connect the curve to curve for the start level let's bring the level node and i want the level one and uh, let's create a copy from it Control c Control v level two and now this is for the sec next uh the end level and now we need a wall type which we can use the wall type node in here and let's select it maybe 200 millimeter will be fine let's go uh let's scroll down and let's use this plug board 190 let's bring it in here now we only need to let me bring this in here and let's just run the script now you have the walls which is great that was it if you want to support the channel or if you want to get access to the script and the uh, project files you can go to our patreon page but the first link in the description and if you want to learn how to create a complex tower in dynamo you can watch the video in here